We're coming up on 639 this morning and we're talking about the future of abortion access and Roe versus Wade. Good Monday morning. Supreme Court is getting ready to rule on pivotal abortion cases two years after overturning Roe v. Wade. The justices are going to decide whether to impose new restrictions on the abortion pill Mifepristone. They will also take a look at whether a federal law requiring emergency room treatment actually conflicts with the state abortion ban. Now, explaining the details now, it comes down to two cases. First is this Mifepristone case. The court is going to decide whether to impose new restrictions on how available this pill is. This includes access by mail. If the court agrees to those restrictions, it would dramatically decrease women's ability to obtain the pills. This is especially in states with new abortion restrictions. Then the second case is actually going to take us to Idaho. The legal question there centers around when doctors believe an abortion is required to protect the health of a pregnant woman. This is for emergency treatment. Now, the lasting impact is this. The Supreme Court has a six to three conservative majority. Upcoming rulings are going to provide further evidence of how far this court is willing to go in curbing abortion access.